Do you think that you can mend split ends? Well, this one claims it does. Let's see if it works. Hello beauties and welcome to the channel. I'm Jessica Yik, the Dancing Ava Lady, and today we are doing a hair treatment. This product here is the Elastin Proprietera Rejuvenating Hair Mask. It's a 300 ml container full of yummy goodness, which is supposed to help with my damaged And I have not been to a salon in, oh, about three years or so. And so I think this desperately is in need. The last hair mask that I did was this one here, which is the Deep Conditioning Treatment Cap. I ridiculously love this product. It is hands down, by all means, the best hair mask I have ever, 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 ever used. And so there was a request to see how this one holds up to it. So that's what we're doing today. This one is, is an in-shower rinse-out hair mask. So you do have to rinse this out. You don't leave it in your hair as if you would with the keratin bonding treatment. But this one, I guess it is more of a treatment, less of a hair mask. So I am going to be jumping in the shower to try this beauty out. It's supposed to be fairly quick too. I mean, this one here, I did keep in my hair for, I think it was like 15 minutes or so. Whereas this one here is three to five minutes. There's a couple of options with this one. So you can apply it like a quarter size amount and um, just either to just the ends of your hair or all the way from your roots all the way down. What I'm going to do is I'm only going to do probably from the ears down simply because I do have an oilier scalp and I don't want to, you know, exasperate any <laughs> any acne flare-ups or anything if it's it is insanely rich the other one because when I did try this one here it really did feel like almost like butter for my hair so I'm hoping that I get the same type of results from this my hair is significantly longer now than what it was when I last did this video and the results from this was amazing. I had like this beautiful texture in my hair. I just loved how it felt. Just everything felt so lovely and I need that back in my life. So you can use the rejuvenating hair mask either, well you do it after you shampoo, but you can use it either after conditioner or in replacement of conditioner. So typically what I do if I am doing a hair mask, I use it in replacement of a conditioner. So that's what we're going to do today. The Elastin Propriothera hair mask, according to Avon's Fast Facts, it is infused with nutrients and antioxidants to help provide deep nutrition and protection from heat and damage. It has a yummy, yummy, yummy uh, honey inspired scent. Of course, it is free from parabens and sulfates. Now, the other thing is it is made in Korea and on uh, the website it is regular price $26 but there's always some sort of promotion almost always some sort of promotion on it this container has a bit of weight I mean it is 300 ml so I think that this will last me quite some time because you can do this up to three times a week so technically I can just use this as con instead of conditioner forever so there are three main ingredients in this to make this extra special so the first ingredient is propolis which by the way I might be and most likely am pronouncing incorrectly but it is a tree sap that bees combine with wax to use as a protective coating for their hives. It contains minerals, vitamins, amino acids, and antioxidants to help restore weak and brittle hair. And then honey, which helps to restore moisture. And then finally, royal jelly, which helps to lock in shine and restore your hair's natural luster. As I am excited to try it out. I remember when I tried this one, it was lovely, very, very nice. The scent wasn't overwhelming. It wasn't as strong as, let's say, the Arctic Fox uh, pool party hair mask that I tried. So this one will hopefully be similar. Because, I mean, I do, as much as I like this one, this one I can get done faster. And also, there's less waste. I like that. So hopefully this will be up to par with Beauty's Beauty here. So let's give it a try. I will include at the very end some comparison um, footage. This is what my hair looks right now. This is what day one hair looks like fresh out of the shower. And actually this one, the footage from here is from when I used the two in one shampoo and conditioner that which is also a newer product from Avon. And then um, at the very, very end, I am going to show the comparison from this mask versus this mask. So make sure you do watch to the end. And also guys, while you're here, make sure you also hit that subscribe button so you never miss a video notification. I know, I know, I have been a little bit loopy with my video uploads. Life has been a bit insane. Hopefully things will smooth out soon and I'll be a little bit more regular with my upload schedule. <sighs> All right, let's get into the terror. Let's go.
I have honestly been doing so many videos in here lately. It seems like I've been doing a lot of videos in here and I have more that I'll be doing in here. I do need to fix up my bathtub soon because my other one isn't working. Anyways, total digression. Let's open this up first. So this one, it does have an expiry date out of it of, uh, of 2024 it is 2022 right now i did get this a while ago though i just haven't had time to film it Ooh, okay i actually didn't notice that this was actually more of a matte finish which i really like i like the texture of this Aww. first off sniff test oh 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 yummy so it is it is a bit sweet it smells a lot like the treatment mask, in my opinion, from what I can remember. It does smell a lot like the treatment cap that I tried out previously, but look at that. So it is quite thick. It almost feels like a butter to me, which is, again, very similar to what we are experienced with the cap. So it might be the exact same product, just in a different format, which in that case would be lovely. I don't know for sure, though. I have to look at the ingredients and see if there's the difference. So yeah, it's, it's, it's not quite as thick as a body butter. The scent is a little bit different. It is very, very, very pleasant though. I think it's a little bit sweeter smelling than the cap, the treatment cap, if I can remember correctly. But it does feel really luxe on my arm hair. So hopefully, maybe it'll also uh, help these babies out. All right, we are out of the shower, fresh and clean. And oh my goodness, I have to tell you, when I opened this up in my shower, it smelled divine. It was so nice. It was sweet, but not overpoweringly so. It was a little bit on the earthy side, but not like dirt. <laughs> Kidding. But you know, it was a really nice set. And even now, it has a very nice light scent to it. Um, it's lingering a little bit. Plus, on top of that, with my citrus shampoo, the Elastin 2-in-1 uh, shampoo and conditioner that I use uh, from my last video, just those two mingled together. It's like yummy fruit salad or like a really nice cocktail, one or the other. So I had already partially towel dried my hair with my microfiber hair wrap that I always use after the shower. Love that thing because when I use it, it doesn't allow the water to drip all over my body while I'm trying to lotion up. So it's very handy. Now the thing is, when I opened up the towel, squeezed dried afterwards, and I ran my fingers through my hair, it was spectacular. It was amazing because no hair foliage whatsoever. My hair was just, like I didn't brush it off. This is just finger combing. Like, wow. So it is very, very, very detangling 100% for my hair. One thing to be cautious of is that after you apply this and you're rinsing, what happens is it makes the bottom of the tub a little bit slippy. Now, I'm lucky I haven't, I left the anti-slid mat on there. Usually I just leave that for the kids. But this time I left it on and I'm grateful that I did because it did make it slippy. It, it, it's very silky. The runoff, very, very silky. It feels luxurious, don't get me wrong. But if you are a little bit off balance, it might be easy to slip. So just be mindful of that. It smells absolutely incredible though. Now, before I went in, I was thinking, hmm, I wonder if they are exactly the same formula, and they are not. Um, I think what it turns out to be that this is probably actually a little bit more elevated in the terms of the type of ingredients in here. It's more of an intense treatment as opposed to this one. So this one might be a better day-to-day, -day, whereas this one would be a little more intense. And did you know, in addition to the keratin and the collagen in here, which this one does have collagen, but I didn't see keratin on the list, but this one also has gold. So anyways, what we're doing now is we are going to let my hair air dry because that is always what I do And then we're going to check out how the results are So I'm always doing my little twist -a -roos like this and it's going to take probably about an hour hour and a half for my hair to dry Which is perfect just in time for me to go pick up my daughter from school And so I'll be back in a bit See you then. All right, it is now a couple hours later. My hair is pretty much dry, and so here it is. I love how shiny it is. It definitely has a beautiful shine meter to it. It's shinier than if I was just using the two-in-one shampoo that I reviewed just not too long ago. So I do really, really, really love that. It is very, very, very lustrous. Is that even a word? It is now. Just look at how shiny that is. Look at that. For me, that's excellent, excellent, excellent. It was so funny because it is insanely windy out. 
if it could do that to the bread, just imagine what it did with my hair. So I was letting out kiwi, and what happened was the my hair was like all over my face. It felt like I was in a tornado of yumminess. It smelled so good. That was the thing I was like, eh, I need my hair, but wow, it smells so good. <laughs> That's literally how I was feeling. Overall, for the texture and the fluff meter, I think it it is actually pretty good. It's not too fluffy. It's still a little bit fluffy when I turn around to the back and I have all my hair at the back. So the good thing of what that means is that it doesn't weigh your hair down, which a lot of people would be looking for. I personally wouldn't mind if it kind of tamed it a little bit more. All in all, I think that this is a great weekly hair mask that I would use. I definitely love it a lot more than the pool party one. I'm just not a huge fan of that one personally. It's it's a nice one. It's just it's too it's too scented for me. This one is a it's scented, but it's scented in a way that it doesn't irritate my 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 scent sensitivity for result wise is it better than this one no it's not this one is definitely the go-to hair treatment if you want something like super super luxurious and super moisturizing super nourishing and it just gives your hair that ultimate texture and shine i do still feel that the hair deep conditioning treatment cap would be the one to go this one though i think is a good one for a weekly a couple times a week and also over time it might also just make your hair healthier because i mean this is a first impression so it's the first time i've ever used it this one is a close second to this one that's 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 the best way of putting it yeah like the texture it doesn't define the texture of my hair quite as much however my hair is also a bit longer <laughs> quite a bit longer than what it was in when I first tried out this product but you could tell that it's it did a really nice job. Is it a good product? Yes, it is a very good product. Love the scent of it. Just be careful if you're using it in the shower, but the floor does get a little slippery. It smells lovely, it has a lot of really great uh, ingredients in it if you are looking for something to really give your hair that beautiful shine. So I'm happy with this. If I'm looking for something for like a special occasion or if I want an extra treat, I definitely go back to the treatment cap. But bang for your buck this is definitely a much more budget-friendly hair mask so i like it will it actually fix the split ends though i don't think so i don't think there's anything that actually mend the split ends but i think what i could do is just kind of tames it so it's not so fluffy looking maybe i don't know but it's a nice product i would definitely use this again and compared to the advanced technique one that i used to have this one is better. Definitely better than the, my, the old red advanced technique. That was like my favorite hair mask for the longest time before I met the hair cap. So great product. If you want to learn more about this product, or if you want to get it to your home, make sure you do go to the link down in the description box below. If you have any questions, reach out. I am here. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you do show some love and give this video a big fat thumbs up. I love you guys so very, 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 very much. And until next time, stay well, stay safe, and stay fantastically kind. Bye.